Welcome to San Juan, Puerto Rico. So we're gonna go, this is a fort right up there, old San Juan. So we're gonna get off, we're gonna go through this building and pop out over here. All right, go, 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 look at this. You guys are gonna be on a fun squad. So we just walked into Welcome San Juan. So we'll uh, we'll come out of here. We were thinking about uh, grabbing a taxi and heading over to the casino. Uh, there's a Marriott casino, there's Casino Del Mar, but we're gonna, we're probably gonna pass on that. Maybe we're gonna do a little, we'll probably stop at a couple of restaurants and get some food samples. We'll do a little, instead of a pub crawl, we'll do a food crawl. And then we're coming out of the, uh, we just came out of the port building. So when you get out of the port, there are people here trying to sell you excursions, uh, tours, city tour. No, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. No, we're just gonna go to Old San Juan. But I tell you, you got a nice hat. I love your hat. Yeah, so they're trying to sell the, the tour as soon as you come out, which is cool. On the other side here was the uh, Caribbean Princess. We'll probably try to get a picture of that later on. Here's the iconic, uh, I love Puerto Rico photo moment as soon as you get off of the, uh, get off of the cruise. So we're coming, we came out of the port and that uh, iconic photo place is right there on the left. We're taking a left and they have all of these vendors that have um, stuff that they handmade or stuff that they have knockoffs. I mean, yeah, they do see some knockoffs here sometimes. I think your Norwegian Joy is following us. So we came left onto the port and we're just gonna head all the way down all these uh, little crafts places. We'll take a look at a couple of the things that they're selling. They're selling Jewelry, handmade jewelry. So there's cr three cruise ships in here in San Juan, in dock right now. This guy's selling glasses and t-shirts. Senior Frogs is down here on the right. Oh, this one here's got glass doing glass work soaps lotions jewelry but you could see there they're all the way down and they continue all the way down but and here is the Mardi Gras great shot of the Mardi Gras it's a Walgreens, and I believe there is a CVS down the way as well. This is Walgreens. So basically, we came out of the cruise port where Walgreens um, was. We went straight up the hill, and that brings you over to the square here. Um, when you come off the cruise port where they have all the um, people trying to give you an excursion, you can get an actual taxi for 20 bucks to the nearest beach. And he said he'll pick you up uh, 20 bucks there, 20 bucks back for two people. I'll never take that. So this is one of my favorite bars over here, 89 cent beers. It's right over here. Once we get over there, if you keep going up this street here, or you cut through these this market, that'll get get you up to the uh, the fort. So there's food, Moreno. Well, Moreno is one of my favorite bars. Eighty nine cent beers right here. 
live music, dancing. It's pretty humping. 89 cents, Miller Lights, man. Marino. I actually like this uh, port. So right up there is the fort. So it's really not that far of a walk from the uh, cruise port. You can get here fairly quickly. So this is the so-called casino, you see? Agato Casino de Puerto Rico. And it's really not. I don't, it's a restaurant. What I saw online was a restaurant. Oh, they got their Christmas decorations up. We were trying to find a casino that was walking distance from the uh, cruise port. And this is the only thing that came up. Um, looks like a government building, to be honest with you. Um, right here's the sign. Casino de Puerto Rico. Construction of Casino de Puerto Rico. It's a private club. Huh? Well, very interesting. Structure was appropriated by the U.S. Army for use as an officer's club. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, no casino walking distance from the cruise port that we can see. Um, so, we could take a taxi, like I said, but we're not going to do that. We're not going to take a taxi. But what I do want to do, or what we do want to do, is stop and get some snacks or like appetizers from local uh, Puerto Rican restaurants. So, we're going to head away from the fort and try to get some she said when i she, you want to go up on the fort all right she said we're gonna go well, right it is at the top of the hill all right she said let's go to the let's go to the fort so we're gonna go to the fort thanks for coming along so this is considered a u.s national park and it's it really is a cool place to go when you come to San Juan, even if you had done it a half a dozen times, it's still cool. It really is. The um, the views are amazing. If you just wanted to come and just sit and hang out and just take the nice fresh air in and look at the ocean, or go inside the park. There's a fee to go in the park. Let's see if we can find that fee out. There's Andrea. I think I, I, I knew the fee from last time. So San Juan Historical Park uh, Castle is opens nine to five, adults 10 bucks. So it costs you 10 bucks to get in. If you're military, free. Access lifetime pass is free. Individual permanent disabilities is free. So that's that's the the scoop. The views down here are amazing. They really are. Look at that rooftop bar. That's where we need to go, right there, that rooftop bar. You wanna go up there? Okay, All right, we'll go up here first and then we'll come back and go up on that rooftop right up there. Yeah, that looks like uh, looks like that kind of place, doesn't it? I don't want to start sweating. Sweat. Yep, Christmas decorations on all the lampposts. Christmas time is just around the corner. So that pink house right there, $1.9 million. And it's right here. Yeah, it's only a three-bedroom, two-bath, 1,900 square foot. Wow. It says here, construction. 
That's new construction, 1.9 million. Well, 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 we'll have to check some more out while we're here. How much for any of these over here? <laughs> I, I'm really curious. There's no price on those. They say it's, it's an active uh, local community. She can't find any for sale down there, so. We'll have to look next time we're here, I guess. We like checking out real estate, seeing what the prices are. We don't put a lot of it in our videos, but we do, uh, we're always looking at prices and stuff like that. Thanks for coming along. I was over there videoing the uh, the water and I had this, this mural over here that I missed. <laughs> so I could turn the camera back on to get it. San Juan Museum right after the Fort area so we're gonna keep heading down this way see where it takes us so we're heading over to a park here what do we got here looks like we got a vendor selling something What are you selling? The pina colada, coke, fries. Pina colada? Yeah. Oh boy, how much? $7. Where? Seven dollars. Has it got alcohol in it? No. Oh, jeez. You had me at seven bucks with no with the alcohol. Did you find it with alcohol? It's more than seven dollars. I know, I know. What's the name of this park here? That's El Morro. That's El Fort we call El Morro. El Morro? Yeah. San Felipe del Morro, but we call it El Morro. Really? Yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much. El Moro is what the uh, vendor had said. El Moro. <laughs> Historical cemetery along the seaside and along El Moro Park. I mean, we're, we're almost in the first week of December here. And look how beautiful it is here. So we thought this building was something fancy. Look at the doors and stuff. It's the restrooms. Let's go check it out. is part of the uh, historical site. $10 to get into this one. And uh, no cash a room. You
local rum, vodka, tequila, lobster. Nice. It's up to you, you're having it. Which one? Are they both from Puerto Rico? Rum? Yeah. So they're both Puerto Rican rum? Yeah. We'll go with Bacardi's. Bacardi's Puerto Rican, right? You know what? Do one and one. It's Cuba? With everything Cuba? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, how do you pronounce the name of this restaurant? Costa. Costa Costa. Costa Costa. Costa. Is that right? Costa Costa. Is that right? Costa Costa? Okay. Okay. Yeah. What's your name? Renzo. 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 How do you pronounce that? Costa Costa. Ah, you did it right. <laughs> You did it right. You can try one regular, one premium rum. Okay. I don't know. You can tell the difference. Yeah, I'm going to tell you we may not be able to tell the difference, but we're going to check it out. We'll see what he's doing here. It's all about the experience. The journey. It's all about the journey. Look, he's pouring a... Traditional pina colada in Puerto Rico is not frozen, it's shaken. Oh, really? That's why, that's is that what he said? Yes. Oh, and there's two shots in there. He put a, oh no, one shot. One's premium and one is, is a local uh, Puerto Rican rum. Gracias. But this is this place, it's pretty cool. So we got this right outside the church. How appropriate is that, right? Nice little restaurant bar right outside the church. All right. He's gonna shake this sucker up. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Go, baby. <laughs> So the, so the Puerto Rican pina colada is shaken? The original pina colada. Original. The original, yes. Gotcha, gotcha. Now, premium, regular. Oh, we wanted a guess. We wanted a guess. Oh, no, I want the premium. All right, here we Look, go. Wait, before you do it, so what's the difference in the color? Can you see the difference in the color? Which one's a premium? This one's a premium. This one's regular. There is a difference in the color. Yeah. One's a white. One's a white rum, one's a dark rum. Cheers. All right, take the paper off. I'm just so excited. Cheers. Cheers. Wow, that was unbelievable. You can't, I can't even taste any alcohol in that one. And I saw him put it in there. Absolutely. So the premium, you can actually taste the alcohol. The Puerto Rican local one, it. Very mild. I mean, delicious. In terms of the alcohol taste. The, the alcohol okay. flavor. The alcohol yeah. flavor. No, yeah. oh, they got coconut there. They put the, the rum inside the coconut. Put the rum in the coconut and mix it all around. Do that one, B. So what do we end up? What do we end up doing here? I 
cafetería y con una empanadilla. Empanadilla. Un cheaper, ¿no? Cheaper, ¿es that cheaper? Uh, Pronounced it correctly. Empanadilla de carne. Empanadilla de carne. <laughs> Gracias. <laughs> that was awesome. The premium rum's kicking in. All right. The other one was Apple. 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 Oh my god. This is. We took a picture of the menu? Yeah, I took a picture of the menu. We'll have to look at it again. <laughs> this is one of our fa <laughs> favorite ports. San Juan, Puerto Rico is just. It's really, really a nice place. Really, really is. Like I said earlier in the video, it's a, almost the first week of December and it's beautiful out. The open, open door bar. You know, we don't want to look over there. That's the trash. But we're going to go down that street right there, which is, uh, you're going to like it when we go down that street. Thanks for coming along on our journey. All right, so I'm getting a Puerto Rican beer. What's the name of the Puerto Rican beer? Melaya. 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 All right, I went with the light. I'm trying to watch my figure. Cheers. All right, lights are on, here we go. But no one's home. Oh, car coming, taxi. I wish we were here at night to see all these lights on, these Christmas lights. But we're, uh, we're gonna be back by 5.30. I love the color of the buildings. The streets, the music, the food. Puerto Rican food is amazing, unbelievable. The atmosphere is so fun. Do a little salsa dancing. Oh my God, it's the best. All right, we're just gonna keep walking down here and we're gonna hit another place, get some local, authentic Puerto Rican food. Thanks for coming along. Look at that street. Holy, f I love the streets in San Juan. All right, so we had to be taking a picture of Andrea, and then it's not every day you got somebody walking around with cockatoos and birds on your shoulders. Look at, they look like they, they like them. All right. Oh. Oh, I'm being sequestered. Oh, she found a place. Is this gonna be a place we're gonna go check it out? Looks like my kind of place, hole in the wall. Oh yeah, we're going in there. We're going in there, that's my kind of place right here. Well, how do you pronounce that? El Bepete, El Bepete? El Bate. El Bate. We're gonna guess. El Bate? Bate. 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 Check this place out. This place is freaking cool. Who designed it? Come on, so who does who designed this place? 60 years. Check this place out, man. Wow. We definitely gotta have a drink here, right? Oh, you definitely got to take a picture of this place. All right, we're going back here. We got billiards back here. Oh my God, this place is freaking nice. 
No butts or drinks on the pool table. I love it when we do local pub crawls. Check this room out, man. Oh, man. Andrea, my kind of place. She picked it out. We were walking down the street. She happened to notice a like a, a thing full of money. And she says, Michael, this might be your kind of place. There's a, there's a tree here full of money. And she says, let me go look. Oh my God, I'm gonna check that place out. I love money. There's the money tree right there. I like the money tree. Oh, there's another money tree here. What's his name? Luis. Como se llama? Como se llama? Is that what you say in Spanish? Yeah, you say to let him speak. I remember that from the seventh grade. I know. And I, 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 seventh and eighth grade. Wait, seventh? Then I stopped taking Spanish. I went to high school where they don't have French. All right, wait. Memorize dialogue. Como se llama? Me llamo Andre. Ven aquí por Juan. Quiero presentarte a un amigo. Mucho gusto. Gusto es mío. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. What the hell? Seventh grade. And my teacher was was uh, Italian. He wasn't Spanish. Oh my God! You're like a borderline genius. Seventh grade, you no, can no, remember no, that stuff. Know, yeah, seventh grade, you can remember that. Mira. Grade, uh, you gotta tell me where you're from. Hold on, Boston. Mira, cómo se llama? Luis. Luis. Miguel. Miguel. Andrea. Uh, Miguel. Oh, he's showing off now. <laughs> seventh grade. <laughs> All right, we're going to order a drink. Okay. What do you want for a drink? Okay, so and what, Luis, what do you recommend? Uh, it depends on what you drink. You I'm going gonna, gonna to go with the local light beer. That's it. That's it. Southport. And, okay, so. A little Irish in me somewhere. A little bit. Yeah, I'm figuring that. I do too. A little bit. New York. Gracias. I figured for New York. You said New York? York? Yeah, I figured for Boston. New York. Boston. Well, Boston. I'm from upstate New York, so we're both pseudo New York. She she went to school in uh, Syracuse. Oh yeah, I know she did. Yeah, yeah. Albany. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I gotta find out what she go with. Where'd you go with? I have it. I'm gonna look at the cocktail menu. All right, let me see the let me see the menu. There's the beers, shots, and wine. Oh. All right, let's flip that menu. Let me look on the other side. Look at that rum chata and Yumi Jägermeister. All right, and then I'm gonna take a picture. Then you're gonna order. Bang. All right, listen, I want you to say the friggin' truth. 73 years old. The truth is, I, I, I usually stay in the house and I never move out. <laughs> I'm a recluse. No, six, at 63 years old, I'm in the first country, on a small little 883 Harley Davidson. 8,000 miles, no windshield. Stop no wind. Wait a minute, do you get bugs in the teeth? Or? South Dakota, and I'm not a biker, but I was told by a guy from home, uh, biker crew called the Banditos in South Dakota, he told me, he says, you're the real thing. I said, no, I'm not. I just ride. I like to ride alone. He says, no. He said, I have people in this in this crew that would kill. He said, they don't have enough to do what you do from Albany with no wish. He bought me a shot. you imagine that? Imagine that? He went from Albany all the way to California at 63 years old without a windshield, alone with a tent and a motorcycle. All the way. What the, what time of the year you left? You must have had to leave in April September. or oh September. So you're trying to get away from cold. No, I was just wanting to do it. I hear you. There's no, no there's there's good Impulse. things. Oh, what the heck is this? Oh, look at her. There's a good woman. Don't let go. Oh my God. This is called the house couple. The house couple. Yes. So Luis, what the hell are you doing over here, brother? <laughs> the house couple is aged rum nice. with your beer. So, cheers, really. Cheers, cheers. Sweetie. Cheers. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Seventy-three years old. He's not even close. Yeah. Which one do you want? Princess. No, we're on the uh, Norwegian Joy. Norwegian Joy. Norwegian yeah, you look like you're full of joy. Yeah, but you look like you're full of joy. That would make sense. Norwegian Joy. No, I'm a sick man. I'm delusional. That's what I tell the young kids. Drugs. I'm from the 60s. Drugs, alcohol. Delusion is the answer. If you really want to oh. have a little time, 
just when you wake up, everything's looking good and it stays that way till you go to bed. Oh. No matter what. <laughs> it kind of sounds like my life. <laughs> My son knows. My son's been all over the world. Yeah. Uh, so China. He took me to Turkey for an overnight. Oh, really? I had the best lamb I've ever had. I don't like lamb. We just got back from Turkey. We were in Turkey three weeks ago. We were in Ephesus, but we went to Ephesus, but we were in Mindu. Sadasi? Is that where we came into? Yes. Sadasi? Okay, we were in Ephesus. It was a capital because we were going to Italy. Oh, okay. Yeah, we went to. Where in Italy did you go? Huh? Where in Italy did you go? We rented a car at some All right, check this place out. Huh? Let me zoom that out. Wow. What was the name of that place? Elbito? So Elbito was up there. I think it was Elbito. I don't know. I butcher these names all the time. It was kind of like a hole in a wall kind of place, but that's my kind of place, man. It was awesome. So this is a hotel, a small luxury hotel. Very cool. All right, we're gonna hit a couple more places, get our tapas and our uh, couple cocktails. We'll slip those in there. You ready, honey? So we're gonna head down here. We're gonna head over to the, the water. It's not where the cruise ship is, kind of like a little water place. I love how a lot of these places got there. Christmas decorations up. Very cool. All right, all right. Cat's Crossing. It's like a cat sanctuary. Help us help them. They're literally everywhere. Your mother would fall in love in this place, huh? I certainly would. I just said that. Oh, you did? Yeah. Your mother loved cats. All kinds of cats, lions, kitty cats, tigers. I think you found somebody. You're gonna. They want to want you to go home with them. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a cat I could. They. They know you are. They know you're a cat person. Look. Yeah, but you know what it is. They know a cat person. All right, he's gonna take all 25 home. Let's get this on YouTube. <laughs> you know they say the cat lady? We'll call you the cat man. <laughs> oh man, that's freaking awesome. Stop for a quick photo at the pink house. Tropical Taste Restaurant. I wonder if we should try that out. We're going to have to ask the boss lady. See what she says. Look at the menu here. Uh, we're probably going to move on, I'm guessing. We moving on? All right, I'm keeping moving. All right, Maryland's. 
lemonade, mango, passion fruit, mango. Reserve the right of admission. That means you may not be able to come into this place. So I'm gonna come down here. So we were down there, we both agreed that we wanna come up here. And I think we were both drawn to the outdoor seating. Look at this, tropical trees. It's not necessarily a hole in a wall like the last place we went to, but I think it'll work. I think it'll work. Well, we got a slot machine. We got slot machine, just put your money here. Come in, put a dollar in. Yeah, and, and walk out with a thousand? And walk out with a thousand? I will tap with a thousand. <laughs> Spending it here. Yeah, if I had a thousand, I'd spend it here too. What's your name? Will. Michael. Lovely to meet you, Michael. Love nice to meet you too. All right, all right. Let's go. We're gonna we're gonna get some cocktails here. What's your name, young lady? Daniel. I'm sorry. Daniela. Daniela. Daniel. No, Daniel. 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 See, I'm getting Spanish lessons. Daniela. I'm gonna, you know what? My wife, she's going to tell me. She's very good with the Spanish. I screw stuff up all the time. So the people the people outside told us about um, a mojito you make. You make a mojito? Yes. Let me see what she wants. Do you want the mojito? The passion fruit. The passion fruit. 102. <laughs> you make this card with a little leg work. Come on. I'm doing all the leg work. You better check here. <laughs> Honey, come in here. For one second. You gotta help me you gotta help me with my Spanish. I've butchered this poor girl's name. Alright. Come over here. <laughs> Say it one more time. Daniela. 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 Told you she'd get it. Daniel. It's Danielle. Oh, I could say Danielle. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do two? I'm doing a little bit of passion fruit mojito. Is that what you want to? I'll go with the local beer. Okay. Uh, light. Okay, for here to go. Well, for here. We'll just sit here. Actually, put it in to go cup. I have the best. We, 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 like, we like the company that you have here. You got very good people here. All right. All right, let's go get our seat outside. How's your travel vlog going? Oh my God, we're working on it. We're, wor we're working on the travel vlog. You want to oh. cruise, you want to cruise? Yeah, you want to cruise? Yeah, which, which line are you on? Hold on, let me pull this. Take a selfie. All right, hold on, I'm going to shut this off. I'm going to do a selfie. All right, all right, listen. We, what did we end up buying? I bought a local beer. What's the name of this place? Maryland's. Maryland's. Like Maryland. Oh, Maryland Monroe. Maryland Manson. What do you think? Yeah, Maryland, <laughs> Maryland Manson. <laughs> Cheers. 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 Let me get this so we get all in there. I have a, a, a passion fruit. Oh, you're empty. What do you got? A passion fruit? Passion fruit mojito. Okay. And I got the local beer. All right. We're going to sit here and have a good time with our new friends. Yeah, we're going to take a photo. This is Will and George from London. And we're, we're just these new friends. They're on the Princess, Caribbean Princess, which we're going to be on. <laughs> Merry Christmas. No, no, Feliz Navidad. Oh, Feliz Navidad. Makes sense. We're in Puerto Rico, right? Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. <laughs> Thanks for coming along. Yeyo. Mofongo. Really? Yeah, really. The best mofongo. The best and drink. You agree? I agree. I'm going to have to go check this place out. Come on, let's go. Let's do it. Let's do it. What's happening? Heavy hitter coming through. We got Monfungo! Whoa! Monfungo! These guys must be from the fun shop.
ship. <laughs> she just said, she, just said, she literally just said two minutes ago, we're gonna make it, not make it back to the ship. I said, which ship? She said the Mardi Gras. I said, oh, I knew right away. When I walked in here and everybody's going, hey! check this place out. Oh, this is my favorite room right here. Woo-wee! Check this room out. Andrea, get the bag! Get the bag! Holy smokes. Check this out, man. The whole room is covered with money. Wow, look at it, huh? Isn't this amazing? What'd you get us? Why don't you go order us something? I haven't figured out what we wanted yet. What do you want? She's here to take our order. What's your, what's your name? Kiara. Kiara. Kiara? Kiara. Yeah. Kiara. Kiara. Say it one more time. Kiara. 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 Kiara, da my uh, cerveza light. Okay. What? Malaya. Malaya. Uh, she might want something that has alcohol in it. What do you want, hon? I'm getting uh, I'm Kiara is getting me a uh, cerveza light. What's your happy hour? What do you got for happy hour? You know everything. Now, do you have a, a, a cerveza and a shot? Cerveza and shot for happy hour? No, happy hour, no beer. No beer. Oh, beer's not happy hour? No, happy hour, uh, beer, Yeah. What is it for happy hour? What's the other ones? Two, happy hour, no beer. Is there alcohol in the beer? I want to see you pour it. Did you pour alcohol in it, or is it already made? Already made. Oh, so that's bullshit. And there's alcohol in it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. We'll be back. We'll be back. Oh, man. All right, let's go. Look, 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 oh, oh, oh. Look. Hubbard's journey with a smiley face. Okay, now what you need to say what is, you have to do is Hubbard's journey. No, no, no. You have to put. Uh, piece of tape. That's freaking awesome. Awesome. That room, that room is amazing. What do we got over here? Okay, we got the banyo. Alright, we'll check this place out, man. Thanks for coming along. All right, here we go. Thank you. Cheers. You know we're gonna have to repay you for this, right? Yes. Cheers. Let me see those faces after you do the shot. No, everybody's face was all right in that one. Uh, he might have cringed a little bit. <laughs> what is the flavor? It's a rum, but it's some flavor. It's good. It's very good. Very good. Very good. Uh, Puerto Rican rum, but I don't know. Are you Puerto Rican? No, no, I'm Spanish. You speak from uh, Barcelona? No, no it's north, north, north of Spain. We haven't been there, but I, I have a friend. I have to figure out where she is. Oh, you're, you're not from Spain. No, her friend is from Spain. She lives there. She is also. You guys, are you guys on the ship? Carnival ship? All right. You gonna do some shots? All right, all right, all right. Wait, they got oh three beers for five bucks. Three beers for five bucks. All right, everybody got a shot. Okay, hold on. Guys, we need to get up and do a little 
do all this shit. We're on video. We're going to do all this shit. Right? All right, so we're uh, we're gonna head back to the gonna head back to our house. Our house is gonna sail away on us. But before we go, I gotta say hi to my good friend Lucifer. So and he's right down here. Right, I hope he's working because usually he works in the morning. And I don't know if he's here at night. So we're gonna find out because I'm usually here in the morning. Are right, you ready? Let's go. All right. Let's go see if my friend Lucifer is working. Usually he's here during the day. Oh my God, there he is. Oh my God, look at this. Oh, shoot. Woo. Shots, 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 shots. Andrea, Andrea, look, 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 look. Oh, my good friend. Cheers. Get over your brother. Get over your brother. All right. All right. I told you, this is my good friend, Lucifer. And this bar is the best bar. He's crazy. He's crazy. I'm not that crazy. He's crazier than me. No, no, no. We're gonna be on that ship for over 60 days. Yeah. We met Will and George from oh. London. Oh my gosh, they were so funny. They were the best, and we're gonna see them when we head over to London. Thanks for coming along. All right, we made it home. Thanks for coming along on our journey in San Juan, Puerto Rico.